Okay, today's recipe is chicken fajita. And what we've got here is some chicken. It's uh, 400 grams of chicken. And what you do is just marinate it in the pack that it came because it saves washing up. So you just take your chicken out. You can just dispose of the packet, which is plastic. And we know how much trouble plastic has. However, it saves washing up. And in the veg corner, we have some red onions, yellow, green, and red peppers. And they've just been prepped. And obviously, you know how you prep veg. So that's in the veg corner. So what we're going to do is we're going to heat up our pan and we're going to sort of stuff fry the vegetables. We're not going to overcrowd the pan because we want them to fry, not to steam. So we'll take a wee bit of onion and we'll take a bit of pepper. We'll just fry it a small bit at a time and remember to season your vegetables because if you don't you'll have uh, bland food so just stir fry them until they're ready and then set them in a bowl and fry the rest off until they're all fried off So just fry all your vegetables until they're just the way you love them. And then you can set them aside and we'll do the chicken. So that's all the vegetables fried off. So let's uh, get on to the chicken now. So using the same pan, we'll just put in the marinated chicken. So just cook your chicken so you get a nice colour on both sides and then you just cook it until it's cooked through. You don't want to overcook it, you just want it just a point. Uh, that means just at the point where it's cooked and no more. So it's important not to overcook the chicken. You want it you don't want it stringy, you just want it succulent and juicy and the way you can tell is pressing it and see how much it springs back the harder it gets the more it's cooked but you must it must be just cooked and no more not undercooked and not overcooked so it's, it's a wee bit of a, it takes a wee bit of practice to get it like that. However, when you do get it like that, it's perfect. It really is. It's a far, far superior dish when you get it cooked perfect. And just to help it along, just put a plate on top of it and that will cook and steam at the same time. 
So once you've cooked your vegetables and your chicken, then you're going to have to do your wraps and you get your heat on nice and hot. Nice and hot and just throw your wrap on the, the ring as so and watch it cook. You'll need to sort of spin it round slightly so that you get an even cooking round the whole wrap. And once you get it like that, that's perfect. Then do another. Get a second or two, then spin it round. Now set the two, spin it round. You see the wee bubbles sort of popping up. Spin it round. Spin it round. Spin it round. And that's perfect. That's you. You just get that away when you're when you're finished. So to finish your wraps off, you can uh, spread them with some garlic butter. Cook some nice and soft and moist. And it's just a case of plating up. So we'll take some of our, our vegetables. And spread them on. Some vegetables. Then we'll take some of our chicken. Nice big pieces of chicken. Just make sure they're properly cooked. And then we'll add in some, on this version we're going to add some spicy mayonnaise. And some chilli sauce. Some sweet chilli sauce. Perfecto. Give it a wee wrap up. And then do your up your next one. Some nice chicken on. And some of your lovely vegetables.
and there you have it fajitas with spicy meal and sweet chili sauce very easy very doable